Hey guys, getting ready to go on a walk at Irwin again. Um, it's a little bit sprinkly outside at the moment, but that's okay. Um, it looked like it was just a small band that's gonna pass pretty quickly, so. Yeah, um, come along on our journey to the park. Hello, hello. So we are here at the Irwin Park again, one of my favorites. Um, here, I'll uh, turn it around for a second, but uh, yeah, it's just, I don't know, one of my favorites. We are the only ones in the parking lot, so I don't know, pretty cool. I'm excited to, here. to walk this. Yeah. I didn't know that. Yep, there's, let's see. Don't worry, you're not in it. It's calm St. John's Worth with a flower. Well, they don't have uh, the flowers I saw here last week. I don't see them. There might be weeds. Oh, well, they're very pretty. Those ones, that's right. I don't think so. Oh. Maybe, maybe they just weren't tall enough yet. Um. Yep, oh, snakes, a ribbon snake. So anyway, yeah. it's stopped raining, a little cloudy, but tree stump. I don't know, I love this place. Just some information here. Oh, look. Oh, the Lou Campbell, yep, we've been there before. Kitty Todd? Oh, I want to go to Kitty Todd. I've seen signs for it. Where is it? Change of plan. We're going to check out Kitty Todd because we've never been there. So that'll be fun. So we're here and I feel awkward because it looks like a house. I feel like we pulled into a driveway. Like, but nope. It's the Kitty Todd. Let's see. Preserve. Oak openings. Natives demonstration garden. So, I don't know. We'll see. I've never been here before. It's a cute little bench. Oh, I guess we'll look at the sign first. Oak Savannah Trail. Oh, that's uneven for sure. So, oh, there's a couple. We could do both. The Oak Savannah Trail and the Cactus Loop. How long is that though? Oak Savannah is 0.5, full thing. And then 0.3 just for the Cactus Trail Loop. So. Oh, that's 0 0.0.1 mile. Yeah. Oh, yeah I, I saw miles of them. So. Pretty cool, guys. Let's go see. Just showing you that. You can pause and look at it if you would like. Yeah, starting at the Oak Savannah Trail because that's the only one you can start at. <laughs> Sadie had a tick on her. So we're walking back. Video, sorry. So we're walking back um, to the car to put some bug spray on. So a little extra exercise never hurt nobody. That's how I feel. I love those two people more than anything. They're my favorite people. It's a little bit hilly. Which is okay. It's good to get different, like, terrain, elevation. It uh, will work different muscles. Sorry, I'm just looking down at the the ground. Oh, it's a big hole. That's a big hole. Look at that. That's a big hole. I don't know. 
Doesn't look like it goes very far. But yeah, see now we're gonna go down a hill. I don't know if you can tell that that'd be down, but it's gently raining. I can hear it. It's raining, but I like it. I like the way it sounds like hitting all the crunchy leaves. Ooh, big mole hill. I'm not trying to break an ankle. Oh, it's really starting to rain. Dang. Look at this deer track. So cool. Well, there's no signs telling us where to go. So we're going this way. Don't know. Oh, it's full of mud. No bueno. No, yeah. We don't have the right shoes for this baby girl. Really? Yes. Oh, I am so sweaty. So gross. Oh, ended up only being, you're clear. Ended up only being point, uh, 0.91 miles that we walked. It got too confusing. <laughs> and, muddy. and muddy. Yeah, as you saw. Um, so now we're just gonna head back home, and then after dinner, we will take a walk around the complex, probably a lap or two. So, definitely get all my steps in and my exercise in. So, yay! It's raining, but we walk in. <sighs> my, my abs are hurting, but okay, I think gonna be the end of my vlog for today so just hope you guys have a great day as I get pelted in the face and I'll talk to y'all later Peace. happy Tuesday everybody I'm back for a day two on this vlog uh, we are back at Irwin I don't know it doesn't say Irwin up here does it I don't think so but we're back here and uh, we're pretty much alone except for one other car that's a lady with I think a kid or two so yeah, it'll be pretty fun. Um, they, I let them go ahead while I read this board. And um, yeah, I don't know. So here we go. I have stopped to sit. My, uh, my foot is just like crampy and it hurts. So I don't know, sitting helps. Helps it so I can make it the rest of the way to where the overlook is. And then, yeah, so, oh, it just hurts. I wish I knew why, because I have good shoes. I don't know. So, oh, it's so beautiful out here. This is one of my favorite parks. Just look at it, man. I don't know, it's just pretty. Remember guys, hydration is important. Get your water in kids. It's so flooded. It's no, I know. I just, I love it. I love nature so much. And now that I'm physically able to be out here, it's just even more beautiful than like, I remember, you know? So I'm out here walking. The sun is really bright, so my face looks disgusting. I'm sorry. <laughs> but you know, I remember the first time we came here this year, I felt like it was so long to get to this rest area, this overlook that we're sitting at right now. And today I'm just like, oh my gosh, we're almost there. And, like, a lot of people just don't understand 
how mind blowing it is for me to feel the transformation in my body and be like, wow, what felt like took forever now felt like such a short walk. And like my whole mindset has changed. Like yesterday I wanted to get as close to 7,000 steps in a day as I could because I've been aiming towards 6,000 for so long. And so, you know, after our walk yesterday, we still went out and walked two laps around the complex. And I was really close to 7,000. And by the end of the day, I had hit 7,000. And um, it's just really cool. <laughs> like, I hope so many of you don't have to understand the struggles, what it's like to be bed bound uh, or house bound or whatever you want to call it. But I struggled so hard for so long for like, I mean, for most of 2020 and 2021, so I don't know, it just feels really good to be out here doing the thing. And even when I only lose a pound, I know that my body's getting stronger, so it's okay. And maybe next week I'll lose even more because like, maybe my body just needs some time to catch up, you know? So I don't know, just enjoy the journey. Like, don't take little things for granted. Sorry, this is, I'm switching hands. Because there was a time when I took walking in nature for granted. And yesterday, when it was raining, it didn't bother me at all. Because it felt so good to feel nature on my body. And um, rain. And just being in it. <laughs> I just, I'm really enjoying my life. And living it. And I'm trying to enjoy every little thing. So, I don't know, just try to be positive. I had a really rough week last week and I'm crawling out of that hole and it feels good. So just don't ever give up on yourself. It's not worth it to give up, I promise. I think this tree looks cool. Kind of looks like it's camouflaged with the bark coming off of it. Just had to share that with you guys. A mile and a half, took us about 70 minutes. <laughs> But we're sitting and enjoying the views, so it was yeah, worth it. Yeah, was a lot of sightseeing. Huh? A lot of sightseeing. Yeah, a lot of sightseeing and, uh, I don't know, it was cool. It was fun. So, all right. I uh, will see you in a minute. So this might seem silly to film this, but this big baby, my big Buddha boy, Bum, he used to be very, I know, my socks are mismatched, uh, but he used to be very afraid of this recliner. And he wouldn't even come and sit on the arm of the couch with me. Because I used to sit in this couch on this side. And he would lay right here. Right on this arm. Right against me. And then we got this one and it reclined. So I'd rather sit here. But he was too afraid. Until recently. Huh? I'm big baby. Oh yeah. He's your baby. Yeah, see these two? They like to sit up here with me too, but it's Buddha time. It's a bummerino. It's your baby. Oh, yeah. I love you. The sweetest boy. Baby. Winnie? Hi, Winnie. Okay, that's it. Say bye, bum. Oh, look at your babies. Bye bye. Hey, babes. Oh, who's your booty bum? Who's the bummerino? Yep. Hey, booty bum. You so handsome and chunky. He's booty bum. He's chunky as can be. He's a booty bum. Bootiest of all the booties. Booty bum. He's a bummerino. The babyest bum of all. Why is you so beautiful? This is a handsome boy. He's your handsome baby. My hair is hot mess. Ignore. But we are on our way to. Oh, sorry. We are on our way to another little park to do just a quick like lap and uh yeah come along with us all right so we're here at the park and uh 
Let's do one lap, but we have to walk a little bit slow. Does that have like a cramp or something in my foot? I don't know, the pain goes away after a while, like of walking, but once I rest and then start using my foot again, it hurts a lot. Are those baby acorns? Baby pine cones. Pine cones. That's what I meant. Look at these Ooh. little, little baby pine cones. And look at this honk. Hi. Hi. It's getting so green. Sorry, Kyle. Oh, oh. Did you hurt yourself? I didn't hurt myself. I got a cramp like right below my knee. Oh. Look at that tree. Isn't that kind of cool? <laughs> What's up? Oh, that's a big one. Yeah. Hammies are like that. Yeah. yeah, you have lots of pockets. Yeah. I always think this is cool too. This huge, like, I want to call it a cave, but it, it's not, obviously. It's just the bottom of this tree. It's so unique looking. Let's go around it. Like, look at this huge like knot on this tree. No say I don't know. It's just really cool and I always admire it whenever we are here. It's a very large tree too. Oh Alright guys, one lap done. At 7,400 steps so far today, so I'm pleased. My goal is to have at least 7,000 every day now. Well, not every day, but on the days I work out until the end of May. I think that should be doable. And then we'll reassess in June, but I'm gonna end this vlog here and I hope you all have a great day, great week, and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.